Oh, shh. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout. We are playing on a Tale of Two Wastelands overhaul with the Capital Punishment mod list. Uh, all right, so we are uh, going to set out and wander further away than we have so far from the Megaton area. So if we look at the quests, I think we're going to continue working on the Wasteland Survival Guide for Moira. Um... And we're also, depending upon how things go, we may also um, do blood ties too. Um, so if we look at this, that's going to send us north, quite a ways north as a matter of fact. Um, damn, that's even further north than Lucy's quest. Maybe, maybe what we'll do is we'll do her quest then first and then depending upon how things go... Canterbury Commons. Um, head up to the minefield after that. Okay, so yeah, let's do uh, blood ties. So we're heading northwest. Do you want to set your marker? No, I don't. Okay, uh, I'm in pretty good shape overall. Um, my weapons are... In as good a shape as I can currently get them. And um, we've got quite a bit of explosives here in terms of our health. Let's see. We are... Our limbs are in good shape. Rads are pretty low. Uh, we have no negative effects. And yeah, everything everything's actually really good. So let's head on out and do this. Okay, so we want to go northwest. Still haven't gone down into the, the sewers yet. But uh, maybe we can do that at some point later. I think that's the house that we found the broad machete on. Right. Looks like there might be st stuff going on in that overpass there. Yeah, I do see someone up there. The chances of that someone being friendly are pretty slim, I would say. Um, let's see. Let's get Yeah, let's let get you out. Or at least have you ready to go. It's got XP. Oh, for discovering Bisley's shack. Okay. How do we get into Bisley's shack? Is this the door? Oh, that is the door. But it's got a hard lock on it, so there's no way we're going to get in there for now. Hope those raiders up on the overpass don't take pot shots at me. There's a boat down here. Go take a quick peek at that, I suppose. Oh shit! That scared me. Mantis foreleg. Okay. <laughs> I was 
was not expecting that. I heard something. I turned around and he was already leaping through the air at me. So, yeah. Uh, my blood pressure just went up a little bit. Oh, there's another mantis. Jeez. A mantis egg. It doesn't look like that's useful for anything other than maybe selling. 12 caps though. Well, that's not that's not necessarily what we'll get from it, but still. Okay. Dog meat, dog hide. What if the mantis killed that dog? Let's go take a look at this boat here. Radiation. Nothing in any of that stuff. All right. Oh, what the hell is that? I hear... The pitter-patter of unfriendly feet. Door to Fort Detrick utility access. It requires a key, which we don't have, unless we can find it up here. Yuck. I'll take the 44 Magnum rounds, a regulator hat. I'm still hearing that. It might be an audio glitch or something. Um, there was something right. Activate ham radio? It's buried. Take the scrap metal. Doesn't look like we can do anything else there. And there's small boat. Why the hell does C fire my weapon? Don't do that. And some water. All right, we've got some cabins, it looks like. Let's take a look at our map. Yeah, this is, looks like some kind of a community here. But in order to get to our destination, it looks like we're going to have to go this way and then across that bridge to Arafu. Arafu. All right, is there anybody around here? There's smoke over there. That place is boarded up. Take the crafting stuff. What is this? Crunchy mutt fruit. Okay. There's an old lawnmower. We'll take the blade. Notice that when I loot a mailbox, the the red thingy goes up. 
Only while we're looking at it, though. Okay, is this a permanent magazine? Let's go data. Uh, wait, where do it, uh, magazines are items, right? Miscellaneous. Collectibles, other. Oh no, it's in aid. Okay, those are all temporary use magazines. Metro ticket. There's another old red rocket station there. All right, whatever is going on over here seems to be in this area. I see somebody over there. I vaguely remember this place from the last time I played Fallout 3, which was many, many years ago. And I'm not sure sure if these people are directly hostile future weapons today energy weapons okay let's do a quick save just trying to look in there to see if I can spot anything significant okay so there's a guy right there but he's not shooting me on sight I don't know what this blue smoke means oh I'll bet you that's one of those gopher hole, hole thingies here, let's put this away because I don't think these guys are going to just automatically attack me. Inspect molehole. Smoke chaser big town can now be transported to. Really? Okay, does that stay marked on our map now? It's not. I don't even remember where or what big town is. So what do I do? Just go up here and click on this? Uh, the green smoke indicates a transporter's been here recently. If you call into the mole hole, you may be able to get their attention. Let's just see what happens. Where do you wish to go? Paradise Falls Scrappy Yard. Okay. Uh, I don't want to spend caps on that right now because we're close enough to walk to Arafu. But uh, it's good to know that that's there. All right, let's go see what's up with these guys. After I finish looting outside of their place. Which I think I mostly have. Take the antiseptic. Hey, who are you? Uh, I mean you no harm. I'm a simple traveler. I'm king of the wasteland. What does it matter? Are you going to let me in or not? No, let's not be mean. Right. What do you want? Um, I just want to look around a little. Don't worry about me. I won't hurt you. Oh, I don't know. I was thinking I'd start a few fires and kill some people. Do you harass all your visitors like this? Um, well, that's the truth. I don't know if he's going to believe me or not. Well, you can never be too careful. Be warned, it's not safe here. Super mutants have attacked recently and carried off some of our friends. Oh, jeez. Come in, just don't cause any trouble, okay? I promise I won't. Nice. Okay. Big trouble in big town. Oh, is this big town? 
Hey, don't get any bright ideas about trying anything. We may not look it, but every one of us is a trained killer. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, who am I kidding? Look, we're in trouble here. If you want to help, great. If not, just please don't kill anyone while you're here. I'm not planning on it. As long as you guys don't shoot at me, I won't shoot at you. Trouble? What kind of trouble? Well, we've got super mutants out that way and slavers up that way. Take your pick. Uh, over that way or this way? They both come in here, drag off as many as they can carry, and shoot whoever puts up a fight. The best we can ever hope for is that they get here at the same time and fight over who gets to kill us. Okay. Why don't you leave? And where are we going to go? Megaton won't have us, Lamplight won't take us back, and Rivet City is too far. Okay. Besides, the bunch of us can't even hold this town. Can you imagine us schlepping across the wasteland? Um, no. <laughs> Who lives here? There aren't many of us left. There's me and Pappy. Red runs the clinic, but she's been taken by the mutant. Kimba does what she can. And there's Bittercup. She's just about as useless as a human being can be. Time Bomb was hurt in the last raid, so he's out. That's about it. The mutants and slavers have taken everyone else. Just us and a couple of guns are all that's left. Um, so it's pretty much a free-for-all here? Where do you keep your good stuff? Uh, well, no, if I ask him that, he's going to probably think I'm going to rob him. Um, I'm sure yeah, you manage. Yeah, we'll see. Um, do you have, uh, what do you, what do you know about these super mutants? What? You've never seen a super mutant before? I haven't. They're mean and ugly and scary as hell. Okay. They came and rounded up a bunch of us and carried them off. God, they must be doing awful things to them. Probably. I'd go rescue them, but then who'd defend Big Town? I patrol every day now. And I got a little present for those muties when they come back. You know what it is? This kick-ass gun. That's what. Yeah, baby. <laughs> okay. Um, do you know where the super mutants took their victims? Yeah. Yeah. They went northeast. Probably to the Germantown police headquarters. They have guns, and they're mean. So you better be careful. Okay. You gonna rescue them, or what? Uh, maybe. You stay here and hold off any more mutants. I'll go rescue your friends. I don't make any promises, and I don't risk my life for free. Your friends are as good as dead. Forget about them. Um... Oh, you know we're going to do it. <laughs> but, yeah, let, let, let's just tell them we'll do it. On, But we'll do it on our own time frame. That's totally awesome. Totally. Yeah, okay. While you're out on your mission, I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Cool. Cool, okay. Hey, did I show you my new gun? It's totally awesome. You didn't. Let's see it. Um, Do you know where the super mutants took your friends? Complete it. Ask the people a big time about their capture friends. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. Where are they taking Try them? Germantown. They always come up from that way. Bring lots of guns and shoot the hell out of those muties. I'll hold down the fort here. Germantown, right. Okay. Uh, where did you people come from anyway? We all used to live in a place called Little Lamplight. But they have a rule about age. You reach 16 and you're out. Hmm. Didn't matter, though. Because you just pack your things and head to Big Town. All the adults go there, and there's plenty to eat. Plenty to eat, all right, if you like eating bullets. I've lost count of how many times I've been shot at. Uh, do you have any traders in town? Any doctors? Look, the only place to go is the town hall, and that's just a meeting spot for us. There aren't any traders or anything around here. Um, okay. All right, I'll see what I can do about your friends. Keep an eye out for muties. I'll keep an eye out for muties. I like your gun, too. Uh, alright, so... This is Big Town. And that mole hole is the mole hole that comes to Big Town. I thought it was leading us somewhere else. This Kimba. Welcome to Big Town. Not that there's much of a town left. Those super mutants keep kidnapping people. So I've heard. Um. Why do the super mutants keep attacking the town? Whenever those things come, they grab a few people instead of killing them. No one knows what happens after that. No one wants to know. Okay. 
there's there's always so much blood after they come and then someone has to move the bodies um well i i asked the other guy all this stuff but let's ask her too oh uh, do you know where they took your friends oh they're somewhere to the northeast in a police station or something thanks for rescuing our friends i haven't rescued them yet where do you come from oh little lamplight is where most of us came from red and pappy and flash and bittercup we used to play together when we were kids then we got old and we had to leave those were the rules so we packed up and headed here like we were supposed to no one told us it would be like this we never have fun anymore and most of us most of us are dead okay that sounds a little forlorn do you have any traders in town no red used <coughs> to run a medical clinic but super mutants captured her in the last attack Hmm. Well, maybe she's still alive, and if we rescue her, she'll heal us up for less than that jerkwad at uh, Megaton. All right. Goodbye. I'll see if I can find your friends. I'm so tired of being frightened all the time. I can understand that. Okay. Let's see here. Can we go in here? This is the big town clubhouse. Okay. Tin cans, an egg timer. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna loot their stuff. Where does this go? Into the bathroom. Okay. This is the common house. There's Bittercup. Nuka Cola Quantum. Okay. A paint gun. Hey, I wonder if these guys have a sledgehammer. Should we wake this guy up and see what he has to say? Oh, I guess that's a gal. Sorry to bother you. Oh, hi there. I'm Bittercup. Hi, Bittercup. Uh, nice to meet you. Finally, someone who doesn't judge me. You know, the people here are just so quick to assume that they know everything about you. Okay. I mean, like, just because I'm different doesn't mean that I'm some sort of freak, you know? It's like... Hello, this world sucks. Okay. No one gets that. They're all like, blah, 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 blah. What's wrong with that girl? Okay. Um, I have better things to do than talk. I know. No one understands me either. God, it's so nice to have someone who understands. Hey, we got fame. I mean, sure, when I left Little Lamplight, I was happy to be out of there. I was dating Pappy then, you know. I got here, and he was like, Big town will be safe, but it wasn't. This place is always under attack. But I don't date liars, so I dumped his ass and got with Flash. But that didn't last very long. Me and Time Bomb were a thing for a while, too. Okay. Okay, gotcha. Um, I won't judge. Uh, who in the... No, let's see. Do you know where the Super Mutants took your friends? There's a police station up there to the northeast or something. Police station to the northeast. Bury our friends' corpses if you find them. I've got enough ghosts haunting me. Okay. Um, I have something to say to you. This place looks like a ghost town. What's there to do around here, Bittercup? I wander around town to find chalk and makeup sometimes. Not like there's any place to buy stuff. Okay. Um, this place looks like a ghost town. I wish it were. When I'm gone, I'll be sure to haunt this place. <sighs> okay. Um, I have something to say to you, Bittercup. I don't know what it is, but we're going to find out. Oh, yeah? What is it? Um, not that I care what you think. Well, okay, don't be rude. I'm being nice to you. Why don't you seem to care about what's going on? If you don't mind me saying you look different from everyone else. I like your makeup. The pale white really reflects the light. Lighting? Actually, never mind. There's something else I need to know. Um. Uh, she could take this the wrong way. 
she didn't say she didn't care about what's going on around here. I liked your makeup. <laughs> That's why I never go out during the day. The moon has such a better shine to it than the sun. Gotcha. Okay. I'm a night person myself. The darkness conceals my activities. Moons are nice. The calm nights away waste a great time to relax. That's not really true. I was being sarcastic. That white makeup is like painting a target on your head. Uh. Well, um. <laughs> I don't really like any of these answers. This sounds kind of mean, even though it could be true. Uh, let's just go with moons are nice. You're not, um, seeing oh. right now, are you? Uh, no, I didn't mean to go that way. Uh, wait, what did you just, I'm not even going to tell you what's wrong with that. But no, I know I'm not in any sort of relationship. Are you, uh, well, yeah. What are you saying exactly? Oh, um, well, I need to get going. But come back and visit me sometime, okay? Okay. Um, I'll try and find your friends, and then I'll come back and visit you. Accepted. Folks have come to accept you for your helpful nature in Big Town. Beautiful. Okay. Um, can I not loot? Oh, here we go. Oh no, I'm not going to loot their stuff. At least hey, Pappy. Another day, right? A visitor. Who'd want to visit this hellhole? I'll bet you're here to rape and pillage us, aren't you? Aren't you? Uh, no. Not that it matters. We're all super mutant snacks anyway. Uh, do you know where the super mutants took your friends? Well, if you feel like dying, go right on ahead. They're up there at some police station near Germantown. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Okay. Um, is there anyone around here who can repair my stuff? Yeah, I can do it. Oh. <laughs> 13 repair skill? Nah. Uh, thanks for offering, though. Uh, where did you people come from? Most of us came from Little Lamplight. We got too old, so they kicked us out. Brats. Okay. Always heard stories about how great Big Town was, where the grown-ups go. But there's nothing here except death and sand. Um... This place does look like a ghost town. Yeah, you're telling me. Everything that could go wrong goes wrong. The super mutants and slavers seem to take turns beating the crap out of us. There's no way for us to fight back, so we just keep building barricades around town. Now nah, we've been pushed back all the way. Nowhere left to run now. Well, that one guy's got a nice gun. And the guy out in front's got a gun, too. Do you have any traders in town? Any doctors? We got two things to do in this town. Suck and die. <laughs> no one ever makes it in this place. You won't find any stores to loot here. <laughs> I'm not going to loot. Um, all right. Are you, no, that's none of my business. Okay, goodbye. We're all going to... Dude, you've got a pretty bleak outlook. Here's Red's clinic. That's time bomb. Okay, no, we're not going to steal anything. Oh, basement. Wait a second. Oh, look, there's some binoculars. A sturdy caravan shotgun. Okay, I can take this stuff because it's not red. I won't be stealing. Um, And I want binoculars and a sturdy caravan shotgun. But what the hell is this guy doing down here, though? That's a little sus. Hmm. He's a caravan guard. He's not a slaver or a mutant. I don't, I'm not so sure I trust Red now, if, if, even if we do end up rescuing her. I think they said it was a her. Okay. Well, still, okay, score on the stuff, right? So this shotgun does a little more damage than the sawed-off, but it's in a way better condition. So, and we, uh, we got 40 20-gauge rounds. So what we're going to do is we're going to put that in three. Nice. And this Wasteland backpack is in better shape than this one. I don't remember which lightweight leather armor. Ooh, that, that gives plus ten sneak. That's really good. 
Okay, so we're going to keep that for sure. We already had all of that stuff. Where are the binocs? Are they, is it something I can use? Collectibles, craft ingredients, key ring. Other? Hmm. There they are. Oh, nice. Okay, these will come in handy. Um, why don't we go back here and let's put those, let's put those in eight. Very good. You know, uh, I think let's put frag grenades in, in five. Good. Okay. Well, I'm glad we came down there. Let's talk to Time Bomb. His wounds are too severe. I must have more skills in Metis to try and help him. Medicine 40 or higher. We put him out of his misery? No, he might survive. Yeah, he's in rough shape. Okay, um... Well, let's go. I'm not going to put him out of his misery. This place gets worse all the time. <coughs> okay, I think have we talked to everybody that's here? Yeah, we uh, we talked to Flash. He's the one with the gun. A protractor. Ooh, a sentry bot. Lawnmower blade. I'll take that because they obviously don't care about this stuff over here. Well, at least that's my assumption. All right. Well, we better get rolling here. I'm not sure that we are ready to be taken on super mutants at this point. So I think we're going to continue with Lucy's quest. Why don't you look where you're going? Uh, why don't you not be rude? Thank you. Oh, hi, Dusty. I'm going to take your lawnmower blade because you don't seem to care. All right, let's head on over to Arafu. Take a look at our map. We're getting close. It's getting dark, too, so that's not ideal, but can't do much about that, I guess, because we're too far away to go all the way back home right now. Let's get this, make sure this is ready. No. Oh, shit! see him until the grenade was already out of the grenade launcher heading towards me oh shit okay um so yeah okay we got the binox gotcha okay yeah let's uh let's try that again except for let's not He was up by that, yeah, over by that shed there. Now it's, oh, there he is. It's a super mutant. There's two of them. Hmm. I wonder if we could pull one of them into the town and then get some help with the other two guys that have weapons.
Run away! Is he? Oh, yeah, he's coming. Guys, need some help. Wait, where is he? Oh, no, he's right there. No, get your gun out and help me. Oh, he's tough. Let's get out of here. Uh oh. What's the matter, huh? Can't stand the sight of your own blood? I. I it was an accident. I think I might have accidentally. Fired on them. A rebar club? That's probably heavy as shit. Uh, guys, it was an accident. Oh! <laughs> it sounded like my dude said, oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, yeah, I accidentally fired on the other guys, not meaning to, obviously. Um. Those assholes in lamplight said that this place was great. Yeah, they did, didn't they? I didn't know that other super mutant was on his way. Let's try this one more time, and if it doesn't work, then maybe we shouldn't be trying this. Is there any way we can, like, get up high where they can't get to us? Hmm, I don't know. Well, let's just try this plan one more time. I'm going to I'm going to try my um hunting rifle cuz it's going to be longer range. Wait. Yeah. Okay. I want to run away from the guy with the bombs. Oh, he's coming. Guy moves fast. I've got one. <clears throat> I've got your back. Help! I've got Where? one. Where? Damn it. Good lord, he's tough. Do I, do you have to get like headshots? How do we, how do we kill him? Oh shit. It's like I'm not doing any damage to him at all. Oh shit. Yeah, let's just punch him out. That's a good idea. This is a single shot shotgun. <laughs> Shit, he's got me cornered. Oh, good. Hey, we got up here. Okay. Critical strike on mutant's torso. Oh, wow. Ouch. He's got two things of dog meat. I mean, I'll bet that rebar club is heavy as shit. Yeah, it's like nine pounds and it's not worth anything. 
Hmm. I don't know if that was worth expending all the ammo. Un he was unbelievably hard to kill. Oh, is that the one around? You can't sprint with your crippled legs. That's a problem. Go back down this way. I probably can't um, fix my leg, can I? Yeah, we've got to put some points into. You know what I think it is? I think we need armor piercing rounds. We got a critical strike on his torso. Oh shit. He's gonna no. use if I survive this at all. It's gonna take all the ammo I have. Jesus. <laughs> hey, we got a missile launcher out of the deal. Okay. <laughs> Did we get any missiles? Uh, let's see. Ammo. But yeah, we got two missiles. I mean, the missile itself is worth 100. And the launcher is in decent shape. And worth 451 caps. All right, that, that might have been worth all of the ammo and the... Oh, man, we are so out of ammo now. <laughs> Doing all of that. Uh, Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it was worth it or not, to be honest with you. But we did it, and so it's done. And we got a missile launcher out of the deal, so I can't complain about that. Um, all right, well, let's keep working our way to Arafu. Maybe there's someone there that can heal us up. And I'm thinking that we definitely need armor piercing ammo before we take on super mutants, because I'd say about 80% of my shots didn't even phase them. I put the gun away, don't hit me. Another soul to add to my circle of darkness. Yeah, okay. We are in bad shape. <laughs> bad shape to be going out here and doing this right now. Uh, I'm almost wondering if maybe we should go back to Megaton and <coughs> at least get healed up. How much is it going to cost to do that? 123 caps. Jeez, that's a lot. Uh, no, that's too much. We don't have that much money. Let's just keep keep going. I have three five five six rounds left. Oh, that sucks. This is a single shot shoddy. So gotta keep that in mind. Well, hopefully that's, those were the only two guys that were up here. And maybe we'll find some st stuff in their little shack here. If there's another one up here, we're pretty much essentially dead. <laughs> okay, we'll take that. Can I, can I use that splint? Uh, 
uh, left leg. Okay, what did that do? Oh! Okay, well, it's no longer crippled, it's just very wounded. Does that mean I can sprint now? It does. Oh, fantastic, okay. Rat away, stim pack, blood pack, and syringe. All right, let's take this expired stim pack. Just to top our health off a little bit. Anything else over this way? Well, if, if those two super mutants were two of the guys that were preying on Big Town, we at least... We gotta go this way. Dealt with them. Having a hard time seeing where I'm going. Moonbeam Outdoor Cinema. Okay. I think I have a camera. I'm going to be kind of judicious about what I loot here just because we're a long way from home. We don't have a ton of ammo. And I'm not in the best of shape. This was a drive in movie theater. That's cool. go this way. Any chance you have 556? Five, five, um, no. I guess I'll take that. Let's, um... Yeah, we're in good shape. Pain spike armor is crit chance. And the... That's a rad resist. It's in decent shape. Alright. I'm not going to take the baseball bat. I only have 24 rounds left in my 10 mil. Discovered Fordham Flash Memorial Field. Well, if we ever want baseball bats, this is the place to come. That's first base. Somebody out there. I don't know if they're hostile or not. Chances are good that they are. Oh, shit. Well, maybe you shouldn't attack me. Yeah. Bitch. Don't Junk food? Sadist armor's in pretty good shape. That gives more HP. I am so out of ammo right now. Oh boy. Okay. Is this uh, the bridge we need? Let's 
just stay on the road here. Or not. Oh, shit! Where did it come from? Oh, damn it! Run away! Okay, I think... I think we need to avoid... her. Because I have no bullets left. I mean, hardly have any bullets left. And we need to get to this... Oh, shit! We need to get to this Arafu place. I have a dog chasing me. That's not good. Not good for him. Let's pop a stim pack. Oh! More rat. Okay. So hopefully we can get to Arafu and just walk right in town and find a doctor to heal us up and a place to buy ammo. And everything will be just fine. We won't have any resistance. Nothing bad will happen. One can hope, right? Isn't that place... Oh, shit! Isn't that place on a... Um, a uh, overpass? Look, what did that say? Lord Death something or other? All right, let's look at the map. We need to go that way. I can't really see what the hell's going on, though. This way. Lucky Harith. Oh, he's the... Oh, he's a traitor. Dude, what are you doing walking out at night like this? Looking for trade. I'm very happy to see you. Um... Okay. Please, enjoy my selection of high-quality problem solvers. Exactly. All right, I'm going to take all of your 10 millimeter rounds. Uh... Oh, what did I just buy? Oh, no, 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 no. This is my stuff. We'll take the hollow points and all that stuff, too. He's got a... He's That's not bullpup. That's bullop. Assault rifle, but... That fires five millimeter rounds, and he only has six. That's not really going to help us a whole lot. It's got a 12 gauge that's in pretty decent shape. And I have 26 12 gauge rounds. I think I'm going to buy that. So, okay, so let's see. We've got. That's the caravan shotgun. But it's the single shot 20 gauge. But it's in good enough condition that I want to keep it. All right. Let's sell the pain spike armor and the sadist armor and the waist hound helmet. I think I'll sell this backpack. And let's sell the sheriff's hat, because the regulator hat also gives us one perception plus five crit chance. All right, good. Anything here we want to sell him? Not really. 
We can have the pre-war money, the two... Oh, no, no, not the food sanitizer. What am I doing? Not that. The Mantis Egg, the pre-war book. Yeah, we're still really low on 10 mil ammo. I don't have a 44 Magnum at the moment. See, I just um I just bought stuff from him not too long ago, so just doesn't have a whole lot. He hasn't really his inventory hasn't really reset. Uh all right. Well, that's the best we can do, I guess. Another satisfied customer. What's your repair skill? It's 51. It's not terrible. That'll cost me 117 caps. Yeah, I don't I don't think I'm going to spend money on repairing right now. Okay. You be careful out there, dude. Until we meet again, keep yourself alive out there. I'll try, and you need to get your inventory reset, too. Thank you. Hey. Hey. What's up? Keep it on the level, and everything will be fine. Uh, okay, I will do that. Lucky's my buddy. I'm not going to rob him. Man, this night seems like it's lasting for a bazillion years. But I have no way to sleep. I guess... I guess I could wait, now that I think about it. That's the T key. Yeah, maybe we should do this, because wandering around in the dark and the storm, stormy rain is not the best idea. That's better. Okay. Uh, we got one of those mole rats with the stuff on him. Are you a big town boy trying to find your small town girl? <laughs> From California <laughs> to DC, the transporters. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, so it looks like we're at Arafu. <laughs> I thought that was funny. And we got some rotting Brahmin corpses. Not really seeing anything out here. Maze. It's amazing. Let's look at that real quick. Oh, this reduces water and food, and it doesn't have radiation. That's pretty good. Uh, speaking of which, how are we doing? Yeah, we could stand to have a little bit of that. So that gets our food to zero. And our water... Yeah, we'll get our water down to 60. I wonder why damn near everything else around here is irradiated as hell, but that. Maybe it's freshly planted or something. Okay, let's see what happens when we go up here. We're looking for... What, are, what exactly are we doing here? We're doing something for Lucy. Data quests. Deliver. Oh, yeah, we have to deliver a message to, I think, Lucy's father. Is that right? Oh, what the frick? Hang on, you're not one of them. I nearly blasted you in two. Yeah, no shit. Get over here before they spot you. Okay, we're coming. Who's they? Now what the hell are you doing all the way out here? 
Well, I have this letter for the West family. What did you think it was? I'm just, next time you shoot me like that, you better not, okay. Yeah, I've got a letter for the West family. That's great, but I got bigger problems than being the town post office right now. Okay. The shit's about to hit the fan in this cesspool, and I don't think I can stop them. Who's them? What kind of trouble? Well, at first, they do their typical gang bullshit. You know, break stuff and make lots of noise, but they always kept their distance. But this last time, they went too far. They killed all of our Brahmin. I mean, that's our lifeblood out here, you know. Uh, why don't you fight back? Yeah, sure. I'll just go and take all of them out by myself. What are you, crazy? Some people think so. As soon as they roll into town, I lock my doors just like everyone else. We could really use some assistance here. You know, I don't mind helping you if you can loan me some ammo. Um... Yeah, uh, glad to help. What do you need? I don't want to take my eyes off the ramp here. There's no telling when the family will return. The family? Can you do me a favor and check on the other people's houses here? You know, make sure they're doing okay? Uh, yeah, I can do that. Speak with Davis West, Karen Shenzi, and Ken Ewers. Dave, Karen, and Ken. Gotcha. Can you tell me a little more? There used to be more families living here. Most of them have dismantled their shacks and moved on to greener pastures. Those that are still living here are keeping themselves indoors, thanks to the family. The family. That must be the hoodlums that are messing with you. Um, where do you think I can find the family? I think they live somewhere east or northeast of here. Problem is, they always travel in the dark, so I can't see exactly where they go. There's all kinds of places they could be hiding. Like Hamilton's Hideaway, the old Moonbeam Cinema, or Northwest Seneca Metro Station. Well, they're not at the Moonbeam Cinema because I was there at nighttime and I didn't see them. Unless they were out doing stuff. Hamilton's Hideaway, Northwest Seneca Metro Station. Okay. Map marker added. All right, I'll go check Just on your, your buds. I've got an itchy trigger finger. Do I look like I'm going to bother you? Maybe I do. I don't know. All right, let's go check on these families. Knock on the door. Hello? Is this the mailman? Oh, I do hope my fall catalog has arrived. Um... Uh... She sounds like she might be a little loopy, so maybe we should follow along with her. Sure, I have your fall catalog. Oh, goody. I can hardly wait to browse the latest fashion. Okay. Please do come inside. Let me unlock the door for you. Okay. What the hell are you doing in here? Get the fuck out. Ken, dude, easy. Your wife let me in. Something about a catalog. Why are you being so hostile? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Take it easy. Uh, yeah. Take it easy, man. Yeah, right. And the second I drop my guard, you pounce. No thanks. Look, speak your piece, then leave. Okay, can you tell me more about what's going on around here? What do you think about the family? So what's your take on Evan King? Evan King told me to check on you. Yeah, this is why I'm here. Is everything okay? We're great. Just peachy. I love sitting in my house with my thumb up my ass. Okay. Tell Mr. King that sitting here all day isn't going to make us any safer. We need to take action. Okay, can you tell me more about what's going on? Everyone is keeping themselves safe from the family. If I was you, I'd do the same. You want to know more? Talk to Evan King. I already did. Um, what do you, what do you think about the family? They're low-life scum who decided to use Arafu as their own personal amusement park. Oh, they're a fun bunch. I'd take a shot at them if I could, but judging from what they did to the Brahmin, I wouldn't live long to tell about it. Okay. Uh, what's your take on Evan? Well, he's town mayor or sheriff or whatever he calls himself. He calls all the shots. Okay. When he says to get the heck indoors and stay put, we do that. Um, all right. Goodbye. Good. Now get out. Dude, don't be rude. I'm here to help. Morning. You must be exhausted from all that walking in this horrible heat. Oh, and hungry too. 
Sit, please. Sure, I will. Braley Ewers is the name. Don't mind my husband, Kenneth. He woke up on the wrong <laughs> side of the bed this morning. Okay. Um, can you tell me about what's going on around here? Oh my, I don't know. Mrs. West is probably whipping up a batch of her famous cookies. And all the kids are playing in the yards. You seem to be a little bit oblivious. It's so nice outside. The grass looks lovely this time of year. Uh, okay, um... Yeah, quite lovely. Uh, time for me to go. Oh, certainly. Close the front gate when you leave and mind my begonia garden. Gotcha. I just planted them. I won't step on your begonias. She's a little nutso. Okay. See you, Ken. Shinzi residence. Knock on the door. Yes. Who is it? Evan King sent me. Can I come in? I'm from the fam. I'm from the family. Yeah, Evan King sent me. Oh, he did. Well, it's about damn time he did something. Come on in. I'll unlock the door. It's nice to see a friendly new face around here. It's been a long time. Yep, I'm a friendly face. The name's Karen Shenzi. Hello, Karen. Nice to meet you. I'm an OG. Um. Evan King told me to check on you. Is everything okay? Scared out of my mind. I'm glad he's checking on us, but until someone nips the problem in the bud, we may as well stay inside forever. Okay. Um, what's your take on Evan King? He's a spineless wimp. <laughs> His okay. best solution to the family is to stay inside our homes and hide. What does that tell them? Well... It tells them that we can be pushed around whenever they want. I'm sick of it. And I'm sick of King. Okay. Um, unless you have your own gun and can be out there shooting with him, though, staying inside your house is probably the best thing. Uh, what do you, uh, what can you tell me about what's going on right here? We're scared shitless. Evan King's got everyone so worked up about the family, no one wants to set foot outside. That asshole runs the show. But does he really do anything about our problem? No. Hmm. What do you think about the family? All they do is terrorize us. They taunt us to open our doors, throw bottles at our houses, and scream at us. If I knew King had my back, I'd step outside and show them just how I feel about their visits. Especially after this last attack. Hmm. That's starting to sound a little sus about Evan King, like maybe he's in on this. I don't remember because it's been such a long time since sure. I played this game. go. Just like everyone else. Well, Karen, uh... I'll stick around if you got a beer or something. All right. I don't think she wants us here. What's this? Oh, that's Evan's house. Okay. Here's the West residence. Uh. Activate Davis. Oh, this is not good. Wait a minute. Are are these guys ghouls or are they just dead and shriveled? This is not good at all. No sorry, Bob. Lucy is going to be distraught to say the least. What does activate Davis West mean? I don't know if I want to know. Let's try it. I lack the knowledge needed to properly determine the cause of death. Check the... Oh, okay. I need medicine 30 or higher. I mean, I'd almost say they look like they got burned. Maybe? It doesn't look good, whatever it is. All right, let's go tell Evan. Poor Lucy. What if there's what if there's some way I could get into his house just to see if there's something underhanded going on with him.
No, I can't do an average lock. What's over on this side? Okay, no getting down from here. Well, here's the outhouses. Okay, well, all we can really do at this point is go talk to Evan again. According to Shinzi, Karen Shinzi, he made me a little sus she made me a little suspicious of him. Well, is everyone What did they tell you? Everyone okay? Did you know the Wests are dead? The family must have gotten to them in the last attack. Sons of bitches. I don't know. They kind of almost looked like maybe they were poisoned or something. Damn it! If only we had more men, we could stand up to them. I'm sick of them terrorizing this town. Wait a minute. When you searched the West's place, did you find their son Ian's body? Uh, no. I only found the parents' bodies. This has to be the work of the family. I've caught that weird old leader of theirs talking to Ian down by the river. Look, I know I've asked a lot of you already, but you have to find that kid. He deserves better than all this. Hmm. Okay, um, I guess I'll see if I can figure out what happened to him. Thanks, kid. You're all right. Next time I see the family... There's going to be hell to pay. Okay, well, if you see me coming back up your overpass, don't throw a grenade at me this time. Or whatever the hell it was you did. Um, okay. Well. My biggest issue right now is I just don't have hardly any ammo. I mean, I got a decent amount of shotgun shells, I guess. But we really expended the ammo killing those super mutants. And in hindsight, I probably wouldn't have done that because I... Oh, here we go. I kind of forgot I needed armor piercing for them. Looking for that special something? Tell me what you need, and maybe I've got your fix. Okay. fixing things yeah he still he still has the stuff that I sold him as well um don't really want to sell anything at the moment um can you oh you're, so you're not you're not really a doctor you're just a drug dealer <laughs> It doesn't have any way to fix me up. Um, how much would it cost to travel with you? Oh. All right, that isn't going to do me any good. Cheers, pal. But you need. You tired of taking it slow? Well, let's uh, let's just go ahead and see if we can keep working on this quest. Um, I think this is where we're supposed to go, right? Find this kid. Let's go to data. Locate the family. We could try to go do Moira's thing before we go back. How far away is that from here? That's where the super mutants are. There's the minefield. There's no way we can take those guys on right now. Hamilton's Hideaway or Northwest Seneca Station. Somebody said something about somebody there. I don't remember what it was. Um, that's 
That's a fair jaunt away there. Okay, well, let's just uh, keep working on... Oh, what the fuck is that? What the hell is that thing? Is that is that a, a mire lurk? Hmm. That does not look safe. That's a nuka cola quantum. There's loot on that dock. I'll bet you this dude's armored. got three armor piercing rounds and eight hollow points shit all right um let's switch to this 10 mil because it's gonna do just a little more damage Okay, we have three rounds of armor piercing. Got him. Nice. Okay, I guess we'll loot that. Oh, shit. Really? We did all of that for nothing. Oh! Holy shit! Run away! Where did you come from? Oh, yeah, we can't... We can't hurt them if we hit them in their shell. I remember that. Does a tr oh shit, he does a lot of damage. Okay, run. We got a giant fucking bug chasing us now. Oh, might want to reload. Bloat fly. Okay, I want to go, uh, is he still, is he still chasing me? I think he is. I want to go get that Nuka-Cola Quantum, if we can. Let's take another stem pack. Uh, how the hell do we get that, though? I guess that means he's still hunting for us. Okay, we've, we got to get our lock picking up at least to 25, but, I mean, we got to do a whole bunch of other shit, too. If I go in the water, I get radiated. Got it. Okay. Let's look at this data quest. Locate the family. It's not telling me... Oh, right. Okay, the, so the family is going to be in one of those locations that we saw on the map. 
I just don't think I'm in a... Is that that bloat fly? I don't think I'm in a position to fight them. Unless we come across some serious ammo. The other question is how do we get across the river? That's a pretty long drop on the other side of this overpass. Uh, oh, looks like maybe we can cross over there. There's some chests. Vacuum cleaner, okay. Where's that? Can we... Is this a single shot thingy too? Yeah, I think... Uh, I think it is. Alright, well, let's just keep it out. Anything to loot. Motorcycle gas tank. That's pretty heavy. And I have one of those already anyways. In case we need it for some kind of crafting. Northwest Seneca Station. Oh, is this like a this is like a subway station? Cornucopia Fresh Groceries. Can we even go in here? Or do we need it to unlock it? No, we can. Okay. Is it, can we get inside of these places? Nah, it doesn't look like we're meant to. This door... Oh. Why am I so low? Oh, I didn't know we could go prone. Well, that's nice. I have to remember that for sniping. I'm detected by... Oh, I'm not wasting bullets on a rad roach. Can't do easy. Can't do easy terminal either. It's brutal. Take some sugar bombs. Uh, that, don't think I'm going to take all that beer. Cigarettes are worth taking. Oh, here we go. Nice. Cigarettes are worth taking, you know, because of their weight to value ratio. A spatula. Harmonica. 
Ram. Turpentine. I don't know if I have any of that. An atomic cocktail. Milk bottles. Um, I guess I'll take the whiskey. Because it's worth a little bit more than the beer. Oh, free war money. I'll take that. Moon tats. Caps. What's that? Blamco mac and cheese. Okay. Well, I suppose... We can go down into the subway. Okay. There's a caravan and a guard. He could have ammo for us or she. What were they? Who are they fighting? Keep it on the level, and everything will be fine. Welcome, welcome. My name is Crow, and I travel <laughs> the land offering vestments of protection. And you are fortunate I found you in time. You are weird. You bear the look of one who is haunted. But I am proud to say that my wares can protect you from even the cruel claws of death itself. Supposed to be acting that Have way? Have a look. Um... What's your repair Maybe. skill? Let nah, it's not that great. Okay. If the clothes make the man, then here are the means to remake yourself. Okay, so he's an armor vendor. Interesting. A storm chaser. Hat. Cryolator. Oh, look how expensive that thing is. Ah, oh, shit. He doesn't have any ammo. Okay, we'll sell him the whiskey. The pre-war money. And that's really about it. His armor's not in the best of shape either. Okay. Another satisfied customer. There, now you're not acting weird. I think he was still kind of in... Um, he still th felt like he was under threat, so that's why he was, like, ducking and stuff. Uh, uh, tell me about your trade caravan. My caravan sells clothing and armor to decorate and protect the body while it endures the ravages of the physical world. My travels take me from Canterbury Commons to where there is true need of this protection. After all, this is what they'll pay the most. Okay. Walk. Evening. Did you guys shoot a... Oh, they did shoot a bandit. Okay. Or a raider. No, that's not a raider. It's a freaking dog. All right. I was hoping they shot a raider so we can get the loot off of it. <clears throat> well, let's go ahead and hop down into this subway station and see how terribly we will be killed. <laughs>